Hello there, everyone. So today we're going to walk you through how to DocuSign using your um, mobile device. So first off, you're going to receive an email from us um, via DocuSign. Click on the email that we have sent. You scroll down a little bit, you're going to see a little icon that says review documents. Select that little icon and it'll bring it up in a new browser. The website will ask you to use your current location. You can either allow or not allow that. Um, and at the bottom of the page, there will be a little checkbox that says, I agree to use electronic records and signatures. Select that box um, to agree to the terms and conditions and select continue. At this point, it'll bring up your documents needing signatures, where at this point, you will select the sign icon. Now this is for Wiley Coyote, so he is going to draw his signature. So, now using a mobile device is easier to um, do your signature because you get to use your finger and not a mouse. Um, so once you are satisfied with your signature and that it is legible, um, select at the bottom adopt and sign. At this point, it will actually have put the signature directly into the document needed signing. Um, and then you will need to sign any other additional documents. So this here is our letter of engagement. We send this to all of our clients to sign. Um, so you'll need to review that and sign. Now at the bottom, it will automatically put in Wiley Coyote's name. And here where it says sign, it will actually import the signature we used up here directly in the bottom. Once that's completed, if Wiley Coyote had a spouse or kids, it will actually get sent to them as well so that they can sign their portion of the documents. Once you've completed all of the signed documents, select finish. Now at this point, it will bring up this page. Um, this will be to save a copy of your document using an account through DocuSign. So you can choose to create an account through them using the email provided. You will create a password and select your country. Um, if you do not wish to do so, that's totally fine. We don't require it to receive your documents. At the top here, you also have the option to download your documents. You can uh, download them as a combined PDF or separate PDFs. You also have the option here to print your documents. Once you have either downloaded or printed or chosen not to, select submit at the bottom. Sorry, select no thanks at the bottom. And it will bring up this page. Now at this point, um, if you had other additional family members on your document, they will get sent the documents to sign. Um, but if not, it'll get sent to us and we will be able to e-file your tax return. If you guys have any questions, make sure to call us or uh, take a look at some of our other videos that we've posted. But for now, 